What's up, everyone? So today we are we're not doing a vlog. We're doing a little reaction video, and I was a little lazy today and didn't want to film a lot of clips. Uh, so I figured we'd talk about Megan's last day at Walmart. Yay! For the because she works there during the summer and then she's going back to teaching. Um, so this is her last day doing. Uh, what would you what would you call it? Dispensing. Dispensing. Yeah. So. Um. Put orders in people's car for online grocery pickup every summer. Me put people's car. They go <laughs> bye-bye. Then uh, And she's way back there because we don't have a lot of room. And we don't have another nice chair for her to sit in. She has to sit in the, the slouchy, um, like, you know, just kind of chill chair while I have the nice Yeah. Um, anyway, I'm kind of happy, kind of sad. I'm kind of happy because working at Walmart is hard and people are mean to you you get yelled at hourly <laughs> but i'm also sad because first of all having two incomes for yourself is great and you get to blow a lot of money and you don't have to feel guilty about it yeah but also because i make a lot of friends every time i go there there's always new people because nobody they hire stays <laughs> nobody's there when I come back the next year, they're long gone. So I get to make lots of new friends, and now I'm going to miss them. So it's a happy, sad thing, but it's time to go back to school almost, and I want to have one week off. But Jamin gets to go on vacation too. Yeah, I haven't said that. I'm going on vacation after Sunday. I'm going to have a week off. So. so we get a week off together, and then I start school work, and he goes back to Walmart. Don't say back to Walmart already. Sorry. I didn't even get the vacation yet, and I'm already dreading back to Walmart. Nah, it'll be okay. Anyway, but, so that's why we're going to do a Walmart fail video. Yep. In case we didn't tell you that. Nope, we didn't. Megan's spoiling it. Mm -hmm. Where I had a big, long spill about it I was going to do. Well, now edit I'm just, it out. I'm edit just, it out. <laughs> I'm just joking. I wasn't going to do it. I didn't have a spill. Yeah, if you hear pitter-patter sounds or like, like smacking or something, the Luna's right here by us. Or if I look down, it's because I'm looking at Luna. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's right there. So we're gonna we're gonna watch this Walmart fashion fails you won't believe actually exist. Peak of fashion witnessed uh -huh. at Walmart. I see them every day. Yep. So we'll switch to that scene. I'm on vacation. I'm gonna do that. All right. And the next thing you'll see, we'll be watching it. Here we go. First up. That is so nasty. I want. Does she know? She knows. She has to know, right? Ooh. Perfect fit denim. That's how Megan pulls up her pants. Hey. <laughs> Just kidding. When you're a star. And she know it too. <gasps> What's he doing? That is a big shirt. This image <laughs> kept popping up. My head. Look, my he's ear. trying it on. Oh. That is a hairy man. Yeah. Keep, must keep the feet warm, yeah. That's oh. kinky. Wait, that's not in Walmart. Yeah, Where is that? That's not a club. <laughs> oh, that's a sh Walmart shirt she had as pants. Nice. Walmart shirt as pants? Yeah. Hey, that's, grand that's my grandpa. Hey, don't disrespect him like that. He's trying to be Aladdin. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what? What the, the fat suit thing? <laughs> what the heck is that? Oh, no. What is you doing? That's her thong. Yeah. Now, this guy knows what's going on. Maybe Why? that was a dare. I bet that was a dare. Yeah. That guy's just putting it on in the He's store. Got He's got one leg in. It like, doesn't fit. I can tell him that. Bro, Ooh. you got the big spoon. I want the big spoon. That's fine. Oh, did he poop uh, his pants? No, no he's he duct taped paint? it. He oh. duct taped it. He had a big hole in his pants. He <laughs> duct taped it. See, Look at the girl. Look do. at the lady. She's like, oh, God, this girl. I'm just wearing me. my not matchy swimsuit. Oh, uh, I feel like that's how I look wearing my tank she's top. Got some back titties. My fat hangs out my back. Part Spectre. of my tank top. Oh, mm. Now that's not her. at Walmart either. Look, they're at like Comic Con or something. Oh, wow, that's a cool zebra outfit. To be honest, I would wear that. No, you want it. I want to let you. <laughs> now what's going on here? Mouth on her butt. It's a know. mouth, I think. Yeah. Be who you can are. Wear a dress if you want. Right. Be who, <gasps> be who you are. Oh. Ain't go. I got time to wear pants here. That's. And again. He can do what he wants. Be who you are. Right. Those are some killer heels, though. His feet's got to be hurting. Wow. That's a lot of boots. Ooh. He's got some cheeks. Is that a man or a woman? That's a man. 
Does that one have a diaper on? Like a diaper <laughs> yeah. On. Oh no. He got the free that's from me. the Looney Bin. Anytime I try to wear a crop top, that's me. Does this guy have a? He looked like he had a gun. Is he packing? When so, you got so much booty. She's got like something, un, like something underneath her thong. Yeah, to to make it look like that. I don't think so. I think that was just her butt. No, I don't think so. Now look, look. This is how they get you to click. They put they put booties in the in the thumbnails. <laughs> Ooh, gorgeous. So. That was something. Um, that well, have you ever seen anyone that bad in Walmart? Not in ours, no. Um, but at any store? No. no. Okay, no. no, no, I haven't. I don't but think I have either. I've seen a lot ruder people. Have you seen that pimp guy? What's he look like? Um, I think that's at a Toka store, my old store. Mm. We used to have this dude that would dress up. I, I don't know what his name was. He's the pimp dude. Oh, I know one. Yeah. Okay. So we have this dude. Okay, you're not. You're just gonna interrupt me and not let me tell my story. Oh, I got excited. Okay, go ahead. But here's the deal, because <laughs> you don't forget stuff, but I do. I've well, got I, brain damage. I know another one from the store. I think you're gonna say. Is it the dude with the brown hair and it's kind of long and he wears the see-through <laughs> yep. tank top? And he with the top hat all the time. <laughs> top hat, yes. And yeah. But actually, I'm really sad for him. We should not be laughing at him at all yeah because he's got a sad life i think well, because he come back when i was a self-check host worst time of my life by the way um he would always come in and he'd get like four cans of vienna sausages which are 33 cents a piece mm -hmm. and he would start off putting all four on there and then he would slide his food stamps card and then it would get declined and so he'd take one off at a time and Sometimes he couldn't get any. Mm. It was so sad. So sad. So Sometimes he couldn't get any of them? Yeah. So he just had to leave? Mm-hmm. Ugh. Yeah. I yeah. get goosebumps just thinking about it because it is so sad. Yeah. That's bad. Ugh. I never knew what that guy's story was, but he wears that every time I see him. He yeah, has... Yeah, because he's poor. Is that the only shirt he has, you think? Yeah. Or one of it them? It like, has like a bunch of like... Holes, mini holes in it. It's like mini holes. It's not holes from like being worn out. It's like a style for some reason yeah it's like what you'd think of like see-through like a see-through shirt yeah that like a stripper would wear or something that's what it is it's just it's a tank black top. and he tucks it into his pants yeah and he wears just regular denim jeans yep. and a black top hat yep he always he comes in the store every, every day, day and pretty all much. he buys is vienna sausages and there's that other guy that comes in that's dressed like a cowboy or something, and he's limping around. Oh my gosh, there used to be this Like Burt Reynolds looking, like, you know, Burt Reynolds' big tuxedo type thing. There um, used to cowboy be hat, these, mutton chops. There used to be these two dudes, and I don't know if they come in the store anymore because of the Rona. Um, because these dudes are scared of everything. And they would always come in. We call them the banana dudes. And they were both old, but one was significantly older. And when I was a cashier or a self-check host, they would, like, come up to me, and they'd want me to check them out, you know. But they would get so mad at you if you didn't, like, you had to carefully place the bananas in and then tie it up two times and double knot it. And only one bunch of bananas could go in each bag, and you couldn't just put them in. You had to slowly put them in, and then you had to double knot it. And they had like 10 bunches of bananas, <laughs> and then they would get water jugs, and you would have to carefully put the water jugs. But like, well, what would they say? He like he would full blown go full Karen. Is there a male equivalent to Karen? Because he'd Kevin. be like, <laughs> Kevin, he'd be like, you bruised those bananas. You need to go get me some more. Because you bruised those. What about the water? Bruised the water. <laughs> you you wrinkled he, the can wrinkled the he, jug. I guess he was like afraid that we would break the jug. Yeah. And we would have to like tie it. I don't know why we had to tie it. And he was like, "My car is small. I have to fit it." Really, I just <laughs> think it was dirty in there. And he. So what was wrong with their appearance? Nothing was wrong with their appearance. <laughs> I'm just talking about they were jerks. <laughs> this is about fashion to fail. Well, they were jerks. So they There's have. nothing worse at Walmart. Like, I would be anything before I would be a cashier again. That is the worst thing I've ever done is be a cashier at Walmart. 
or self check host at Walmart. OGP is a lot harder, like physical labor type yeah. work. Yeah. But oh my gosh, the people are so much better. Like the people that come in store are the worst people. Like they're not sending their good people; they're sending their worst people to come in the store. The online grocery people are usually better because they're like, oh, I'm not having to go in the store. Mm -hmm. But the people that are going in the store are just gremlins. Gremlins. <laughs> yeah. Like you. You like to go in the store. You're a gremlin. Yeah, I do like to go in I the like store. I like to do OGP because I'm not a gremlin. I just like to I like to walk the aisles and look at look at the food and see new foods. And that's like, oh, this might be good. But Dude, if... that's literally your job. That's what you do is you walk through the aisles and look at stuff. Why yeah, you want to look at stuff in your free time? Well, just because maybe it looks better when I'm shopping for it, like for myself and not for other people, you know. But uh, I think that's I think that's it for this video. Um, thank you guys for watching. Long. I know we could literally talk about it like for hours, but I didn't want to have too long. Six of a video. hour video about yeah. Megan complaining maybe, about Walmart. Maybe we'll do a uh, Walmart podcast complaining about Walmart <laughs> podcast. That's what I need to do right for there. one hour rants. If anyone wants to see that, so <laughs> just ask for it, request it. So Megan, you want to do the sign off for this? Do you want to do the sign off? What's the sign off? Like. Ask people to subscribe and like videos. Goodbye, friends. You can like and comment and subscribe if you want. You don't have to. But, okay. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Thanks for watching.